Having trouble diagnosing a wheel speed sensor? Well, I got a quick trick for you to use that just requires you to pull the sensor and just give it a little pinch. Next. This video is sponsored by BCA Bearings, the number one supplier of OE quality hub assemblies. Visit bcabearings.com for more information. So if you get one of these erratic codes, it is a good idea to pull the wheel speed sensor from either the knuckle or the hub unit and take a look at it. Measure the resistance and give it a pinch or a squeeze to see if the resistive value changes. This is typically a sign that internally something has failed. On the passive, it could be the coils going around the magnet. On the active wheel speed sensor, well, it could be the wiring going to the wiring harness. So what damaged the wheel speed sensor? Well, typically it's rust and corrosion in the bore that holds the wheel speed sensor. This rust can squeeze the wheel speed sensor itself and possibly hurt the internal components inside the wheel speed sensor. So there it is, pull the sensor, give it a pinch and measure the resistive value and make sure it stays constant because if it doesn't, well, these are internally damaged. I'm Andrew Markell, thank you very much.